First, we'll go ahead and reduce by canceling the 14 and the 7, making this a 2 and the 1, and also the 3 and the 9, where this becomes a 3, and that becomes a 1. Here's another one. When you have square root of 27 and square root of 3, we could go ahead and reduce or cancel off the numbers inside the square roots, but not the square root itself. Next, when we have the cube root of 16 and cube root of 2, we can go ahead and reduce this into an 8 and that into a 1, where we're left with this. Notice that we have 1s in the denominator, where if we simplify, we end up getting this. And of course, this will be 2 times 3 times 2 times 3, or 36.